Welcome back to Smart Light Dimwit. Today we're going to take a look at two similar products from Cololite, the Mix Acid and the Mix Pro, and explain their key differences. I recently ordered some of the Cololite Mix Pros, seen here. However, I'm not going to go into an in-depth review on them, as that's already been done by several other channels, and I don't have much of anything new to add to that discussion. Long story short, the Cololite Mix Pro has a unique look, it's easy to set up and use, and effectively add some underrepresented geometry to your RGB LED installation. However, they stumble when it comes to precision control, i.e. you cannot control each circle individually without paying for the more expensive master tiles, and then you'd be running a bunch of additional cords. Also, the Color Light app leaves a lot to be desired in terms of appearance and clarity. That being said, their sound reactivity works rather well, so if that is a feature you are concerned about, you could certainly do a lot worse than a set of Color Light Mix Pros. At the time this video was posted, you can acquire a 3-pack of Color Light Mix Pros for $99.99, individual extension tiles for $44.99, and then at $49.99 is the Color Light Mix Acid single tile in pink or white. Color Light was kind enough to send a white Mix Acid tile for review. At first glance, the two products look identical, but have different key feature sets that are important to consider. The Mix Pro Black is a Wi-Fi version that supports app control and works with smart platforms such as Amazon and Google Home. The Mix Acid, available in pink or white, is a Bluetooth version that supports gesture control, app control. The surface material has been upgraded to a matte texture but it does not work with the previously mentioned smart platforms. Colors and effects look fantastic on the Mix Acid tile, and I do love that, like the Mix Pros, this has a magnetic backing for easy installation. But beyond that, Color Light's choices become questionable. Most users that choose to install RGB LED tiles tend to install more than one. However, Color Light has effectively crippled the Mix Acid, leaving it currently unable to attach to any other tile. This in spite of providing you with a couple of their proprietary connecting pieces. Yes, you could group the Acid with other installs, but there are no expansion packs available, and you cannot connect Mix Acid to Mix Pro or Mix Pro extensions, nor should you connect multiple Mix Acids together. They do leave the window open for extension possibilities. If you read the back of the box, you'll see the following, all the more so if connected with multi-blocks and future connectable modules. Now, the Mix Acid debuted at CES in 2021, and here we are a third of the way through 2023, and those future modules have yet to materialize. Why Cololite did not choose to offer the Mix Pro in these alternate colors with the same feature set and make them all work together is beyond me. Even the gesture control, which is the defining feature of the Mix Acid, must first be activated via the app or button press and seems wholly unnecessary if you are already close enough to be pressing buttons. And for some reason, Cololite thought it would be a good idea to provide you with a sticker pack so that you could deface your mix acid tile. <sighs> Should Color Light decide to offer extension packs for the acid, or if for some bizarre reason you are only interested in installing a single RGB LED tile, then the acid would be a fine choice. Until then, if you want to add some circular lights to your interior, I'd recommend you stick with the less expensive Mix Pros. That's about it for today. Keep your eye on the channel. We've got several new videos planned for the coming weeks. And be sure to check out smartlightdimwit.com for free gift downloads that are perfect for use with your twinkly squares. Until next time, peace and illumination.